welcome back to my channel if you're new here welcome if you're an od welcome back guys so today we're doing something new we are doing trying out the new elf eyeshadow application glitter stick whatever you want to call it and i'm also trying out the um milk hydro grip primer so without further ado guys let's just go ahead and get into the video all right guys so i wanted to try out i had seen that elf has this new eyeshadow that has the um application and the shimmer and it's like glitter so this blue is i have um i actually have I actually have both the gold. I have the I got the gold one. Does it have a name? The gold is called Flirty Bird, and the blue is called Ocean Eyes. So what I'm gonna do today is apply the blue. I feel like blue is more. Or y'all think I should do? Let's let's do gold. I think I should do the Flirty Bird because I don't know what y'all think. Like I think I should do. I'm gonna do a video on both. But I'm feeling like the blue may be it today, y'all. Like, y'all feeling this? Open ocean eyes. I was already aiming towards blue until I took the gold out, and I'm like, oh, maybe I should do that one. But let's just keep it going. I was already gonna do the blue, but when I pulled out the gold, it was kind of like saying, like, mm, use me. So we're gonna do the blue. So what I'm gonna do here is, um. Let's get started guys. Let's see what we're gonna create a look here today. I think I'm gonna do something really simple with it. Simply because it's my first time trying it and that it I already have like a shimmer to it. So you don't wanna I don't wanna do too much right now without knowing how it applies, how um the consistency of the product is. So let's go ahead and get started. I'm gonna do one off camera and then we're gonna come back and do the other one. Alright, y'all. So let's get to it. Okay, look at me. So <laughs> So what I did is I went in with the brother from the James Charles Morphe palette um, as the base color for my lid. Um, and then what I did as like transition or faded up to the arch of the brow, I went in with the Juvia's Place Warrior 3 palette and I went in with the shade Gola and I used that as a transition shade to blend up to the arch. So I'm just gonna do that in these next couple steps and then we're gonna come back um, when we apply the um, ocean eyes by Elf. So we pretty much have the base now for this eye. Oh, it looks so good, y'all. So now I'm going in with the Ocean Eyes by Elf, and we are going. The applicator looks like this, which is really good for um, it being an eyeshadow base. Well, not an eyeshadow base, but for an eyeshadow because it allows you the uh, ability to smooth out the shadow and evenly distribute it. Although we're not going to really use it to that advantage today, I just want to throw that out there, guys, that this is a great application because of the fact that it is for eyeshadow and the flat brush does allow you to evenly distribute the product and blend it out on your lid. So that is definitely a plus for me. What I'm going to be using today is my Morphe um, M321 brush. I'm using this because of the type of application brush it is. It'll help me apply and distribute in a blot method towards the lid because I want it to go in certain areas of the lid. So let's go ahead and get started and apply this product. Mm -hmm. So y'all see it's on my lid and what I'm gonna do is use the application and just like blot it around the bottom 
and work it up. I don't want it to be like there in the top. I want it to blend out to the top. I want it to like match the eyeshadow, so. Okay, okay, ooh. Okay, so what we're gonna do guys is give it a second to let it dry for a second and then we're gonna go in with one more layer and then we'll be done for the lids and then we're gonna go. Um, as you guys know, or maybe, maybe I haven't even talked about it, but I recently got my eyelashes um, done, but they are in need for a fill, so I haven't got that done yet. So what I'm gonna do is I put a strip on, but you know I do my lashes off camera, so. Once we do a second layer, we're gonna do that off camera and then um, come in, we're gonna do the face. since we are trying a new eyeshadow i'm going in with the i wanted to try the milk hydro grip i've heard good things about it so i wanted to use that on this look today as well oh yeah my eyes look so bad oh. yeah look at my cheeks they so high i guess i'm so excited look at them they so high oh my god they're like ready so my initial reaction is so cold oh but it's so smooth Y'all know me, I put it in my T-zone area. My face is already moisturized, so I'm just going in with the primer. Oh, it feels good, y'all. Put it in all the areas that I have a lot of uh, um, blemish control. Ooh, it looks like it dries quick, so I ain't move fast. Oh, ooh, it feels good, y'all. Mmm. That's a good thing if it goes fast. It's like it's like it gets like um as it starts to dry, you can feel like a like I oh that's so good. Okay. Um it gives you like a um consistency of like tackiness, so that's good. Okay, y'all. So I'm going to use today um some clin I'm gonna use my Clinique. Um and I'm gonna use it as my foundation today. So we're just gonna go ahead. Mm. Why is this woman? I'm looking real shiny right now, so I'm going in with some pressed powder by Maybelline in the shade 330. And I'm feeling really like tan-like, but I think I know how to fix it. Yeah, and I think because it's getting warmer now, my skin tone. Well, not even my skin tone. I don't even think that matters. Yeah, but she's coming down some. And a press powder will definitely help out with the oiliness. If you have, a, if you're oily skin, it'll help um, tone down that, so that way you don't have too much of those type of issues. Next, what I'm going to do is go in with my concealer, and I'm going in with the medium beige um, by Elf as well. And we're just going to start doing a T-zone. Just going to start doing the T-zone area. So let me go ahead and conceal. Um, 
So I'm about to go ahead and contour my face and highlight the L's areas and I will be back. Alright guys, thank you so much for watching. If you made it this far, don't forget to thumbs up, like, subscribe, and hit that notification bell so you don't miss an upload, guys. I hope you guys enjoyed it. If you try the e.l.f. Um, eyeshadow, let me know. Comment in the comment section below which one is your favorite. I do want to try the gold one next that I do have. But definitely, um, if you did any recreations of this look, put it in the comment section below what you did and didn't like about the product guys but i definitely want to thank you guys so much for continuing to watch support and share my videos it is greatly appreciated and i love you guys so much but as always stay true and stay you and i will see you guys in the next video